Hello guys, this is my last set, and today we are going to be using <laughs> polygel, and it's been a minute since I posted a nail tutorial, but since a lot of you people know I do my nails on Instagram, you have been requesting me to do my nails, and the video from a year, almost two years ago, when I was doing my acrylic nails, I improved so much more, but I'm still learning, it's a, it's a learning process, okay, and I had taken a break since my last job. I had gotten a job around April or May till August. And I wasn't allowed to do nails until my new job that I got in August. Which is amazing because now I'm starting to do more nails because I love nails. Anyways. Yeah. But today I'm going to be doing poly gel nails. And I'm testing the one from my cart. I believe that's how you pronounce it. This is the one that a lot of people do use when you watch YouTube videos to searching poly gel nail. And I really love poly gel nail. And it's better than acrylic in my opinion. I mean, doing gel nail since I was 12, it was always easy for me. But also, I didn't know what I was doing because I was so young. And the last time that I did gel nails, I was, I believe in junior and high school when I had found out my my gel kit but anyways but this is easier than acrylic it doesn't smell which i hate the smell of acrylic and the monomer and acrylic is fat it dries faster and you don't have to worry about oh poly gel drying because you can work your time with the rubbing gall which is amazing that's amazing so yeah And the nail, uh, sorry, the gel builder that I'm going to be using is 09 Dark Pink. And, and, oh my god, I literally cannot speak today. But the gel is a very beautiful light pink shade. I would not say it's dark, but it's dark in that collection, which it is true. And I'm taking the dual form and some rubbing alcohol. And usually, usually, sorry, usually... I will tap and I work my way to the middle and I usually go up and down. This is, it's very hard to really describe, but as you guys can see in the video as the technique that I do. And I also flip it around to make sure that I don't have any clear spaces. So once I'm done building the gel, I place it on my nail and cure it for 60 seconds and remove it. It's that simple <laughs> you want to grab your nail door form and place it on your nail and put a little bit of pressure and some gel does squeeze out all you have to do is get some rubbing alcohol and get your brush and swipe it away so you don't have that weird type of texture when you, once you cure it <laughs> And also, I truly do apologize. This video is kind of ratchet with the different placements and lighting. So, sorry. So, yeah. So, yeah, that was pretty much a quick demo on how you do poly gel nails. So, when you do poly gel nails, you first start with the base um, top coat. And after you finish doing the base top coat, you want to cure your nails for about, not about, but it is 60 seconds. And after you're finished, then that's when you do apply your door forms. All you would do is grab whatever gel that you want to use and get the nail dual form and place the gel with the rubbing alcohol and place it on your nail and cure it for 60 seconds and that's how easy it is 